Hey everybody, welcome back. Happy Wednesday. I hope everybody's doing good today. I'm doing great. Back with more job opportunities for you. And in this video right here, I'm going to have several job opportunities that do not involve you talking to customers all day, okay? So you guys already know we're going to go ahead and get straight into it. Just to let you know, at the time of me doing this voiceover, I have not looked up any pay for these jobs yet. So if I do find out the pay for the jobs, you will see it on the screen at some point during me doing the voiceover, okay? So let's get straight into the first job with the company Ovation Healthcare. They're looking for a call center QA specialist. This company is based in Brentwood, Tennessee. I don't see anything in the description stating that you have to be in Brentwood to work this job. It is a remote part-time job and with this job right here you're going to need a GED or high school diploma, proven experience, analyzing, interpreting, and summarizing complex data as it relates to contact center technologies that's required, one to two years of experience with contact center quality assurance systems and or processes is preferred, and three plus years as a call center agent can substitute if you don't have any QA experience. So with this job right here, you will be creating, updating, and analyzing and distributing reports as needed. You're going to complete agent code changes daily and perform call monitoring and provide trend and performance data to the management team. You will review data from quality management systems to track performance at team and individual levels to provide actionable data to the management team. And you're going to use customer service expertise to assess existing practices for improvement opportunities. You will coordinate and facilitate call calibration sessions for the management, including selecting calls for review and taking meeting minutes. You'll assist other departments with locating calls that are not in insight or asteria so you do need to be familiar with basic call center workflow and processes experience with voice trails or similar evaluation software is preferred be familiar with qa processes and practices be focused on quality and customer service and have an understanding of quality assurance metrics a working knowledge of windows based systems and microsoft office products and an understanding of legal rules and regulations pertaining to hipaa you also need to have active learning skills critical thinking skills writing and reading comprehension skills and so let's move on to the next job this one right here is coming from the company bloom and I've mentioned before that I do have subscribers that have gotten hired to work with this company currently they're looking for a seasonal quality assurance representative to work remote their headquarters are in Bloomington Indiana nothing here saying that you have to be there with this job you will conduct quality monitoring of call center agent recordings using documented standards and systems to identify trends and make recommendations for improvement you're going to identify performance gaps in soft skills administrative service and establish policies or processes and summarize findings and recommend solutions to management for individual and systematic or process improvements you will collaborate with the call center management team to implement solutions and document agent interaction with callers for both agent feedback and tracking purposes you will flag compliance issues when identified and escalate to the appropriate department and communicate with managers on agent progress and follow-up. You will review Bloom intranet, emails, and agent folders to stay updated on program specifics and keep informed on daily client requests through monitoring teams, channels, and QA group chats and incorporate those into the evaluation forms. You will attend calibration sessions if scheduled by the client and manager. Also assist in other projects including live monitoring and our coaching and assist with onboarding new quality assurance representatives through nesting activities you will need a high school diploma or GED an experience in customer service call center experience and or quality review in a call center environment is preferred be proficient with Windows specifically Excel strong comprehension skills robust writing skills detail oriented be able to work independently and always maintain discretion and professionalism regarding agent performance let's move on to the next job and this one right here i actually have two jobs with this company this is exam works and i featured exam works on the channel many times keep an eye out for them because they tend to have data entry jobs but this is going to be their job as an assistant file coordinator and so with this job it is remote you're going to have a standard work schedule monday through friday from 8 a.m 
a.m. to 5 p.m. That's going to be Eastern Standard Time Zone. So with this job, you will be dropping rated ages and files. You're going to assist the file coordinators with mailing out hard copies of the invoices and reports when needed. You will appropriately document the operating system, which is Galileo, with all notes and emails pertaining to the file. You will process incoming parcel mail for the file coordination department and upload files into caseworks for all Med Insights files. You will transfer files from the prior operating system, which is ProLaw, to the current operating system. And you're going to abide by all rules of the company, such as safety, confidentiality, and organizational directives. You will maintain confidentiality of all personal and financial information at all times in accordance with HIPAA regulations. And you will have other duties as assigned by the lead file coordinator, the supervisor, and the manager. So a high school diploma or GED is required. A minimum of two years clinical or related experience or equivalent combination of education and experience is required. Medicare knowledge or experience is a plus and you must be knowledgeable of multiple software systems including but not limited to Microsoft Word, Outlook, Excel, and the internet and demonstrate accuracy and thoroughness and you must demonstrate exceptional communication skills by conveying necessary information accurately and listening effectively and you must be able to maintain confidentiality. So let's move on to the next job with exam works. And this is going to be their job as a conditional payment specialist. You will have that same schedule as I mentioned in the previous job. And so you'll be evaluating Medicare conditional payment letters, notices, and demands to determine the appropriate course of action and provide claims appropriate recommendations to clients. You will work with the ECS sales team and client and claims handler to obtain all necessary information in order to successfully perform appeal or dispute. You're going to be handling conditional payment correspondence upon receipt and create clear, concise, and articulate disputes and or appeals on behalf of ECS clients. You will appropriate documentation of all system notes and emails and also work with the team manager to ensure client correspondence is logical and up to date. You will assist with addressing issues and solving problems as needed and regularly communicate with management and provide support as needed. You will perform quality assurance as needed and perform introductory training to new employees and ongoing training to staff in the conditional payment department as needed. So you need to have one to three years of administrative clerical experience, also a strong knowledge of multiple software programs, including Microsoft Word, Outlook, Excel, and the internet, exceptional communication skills, be able to work independently, and again, Medicare experience is a plus. The next job is coming from the company Keepsake and Keepsake is looking for a customer success associate to work full time. So this is going to be a no phone job. You're going to be assisting customers via email. Of course, you're going to be working from home. You do need to be open to working weekends and increased hours during their peak season, which is from November 25th to December 20th. Now I have applied with this company in the past. They will have like an activity that you'll need to do where you're responding to customers via email. So, you know, make sure you do that and make sure your grammar is on point and everything like that. But you will be providing the best support and communication for the customers via email. You'll be responding to questions, concerns, and feedback in a positive, concise, and empathetic manner, escalating internally when appropriate. You will have positive exchanges with customers to help build relationships and deepen the connection of the brand and recognize customer trends or issues and collaborate with internal teams on solutions to improve the customer experience. You will proactively reach out to customers to increase engagement and participate in testing new features and app releases. And you will strategize and execute on new methods for customer success and relationship building. So they'd like for you to have a bachelor's degree, have excellent written communication skills, and be able to relay information clearly, be an entrusted problem solver, have a willingness to take on new challenges, and a passion for going above and beyond. And you do need to be someone who thrives in an at-home work environment, and you've played around with Photoshop and or have an understanding of simple photo editing, okay? So the next job is coming from the company Partner Hero, and they're also looking for a contact center QA specialist. This is full time, and for this one right here, it's only gonna be available in a few states, so you would need to be in North Carolina, Florida, Michigan, Virginia, or Texas to work this job. This job is gonna start May 2nd, 2024. You will be reviewing and scoring associate interactions according to an established rubric 
evaluating for quality and compliance. You will be preparing reports for team leads, program managers, and other key stakeholders regarding trends in associate performance and opportunities for process or training improvements. You will participate in root cause analysis of qualitative and quantitative data regarding individual and team-wide performance, and you will utilize a quality scoring tool to log insights and provide product feedback to improve the tool. You're going to assist in training and mentoring other QA specialists as needed and participate in regular meetings for calibration and coaching strategies. You will be developing insights and recommendations from analysis of quality audits and creating reports for leadership and other key stakeholders. You will be assisting with tickets during backlogs as requested, so they'd like for you to have at least one year of experience as a QA specialist, strong knowledge of customer support best practices, and understanding of the importance and impact QA can have on a support organization, strong oral and written communication skills, excellent time management skills, and be able to identify trends, data-driven reporting abilities, using visualization, spreadsheets, and other data. And it will be a bonus if you have previous quality monitoring experience and previous work experience at a startup and experience working in remote environments. You are going to get benefits with this job. So yeah, these are all of the jobs that I have for you guys. You already know. If you're interested, Head straight to that description bar. I'll put the direct links to the jobs there for you. If you have any questions or any comments, leave those below. And you guys know that I appreciate you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Good luck to everyone who applies for the jobs.